It's Fan Friday. It's all about you guys and your comments. The NBA All-Star starters have been announced. I don't know who cares. The Giants and Patriots face off in the Super Bowl this Sunday and LeBron James's hairline. <sighs> Hi, we're the Nick City Dancers, and you're checking out JR Sports Brief. That's kind of awesome, isn't it? So I hope everybody's having a great Friday. It's the day that I go through all of your comments and hit you guys back via video form. And before I get started, we know we have the Super Bowl on Sunday, but on Monday, I'm going to be a part of a Google Plus hangout with Darren Ravel of NBC. And we're going to be talking about the game. And we're also going to be talking about the commercials. Hit me up on Twitter. Also go find me on Google Plus for all of the details on that. But we're going to go into the comments now and we're going to start with this comment from Mr. D. Yar Adin Yurt on Twitter, and he simply says, who will win the NBA All-Star game, the East or the West? Now, I'm pretty sure last night you guys heard that LeBron James, Dwayne Wade, Carmelo Anthony, Kobe Bryant, or Andrew Bynum for the first time, all of the All-Star starters were announced. And to my surprise, a lot of people actually care. People were hitting me up on Twitter talking about, yo, why didn't so-and-so make it? What do you think about so-and-so didn't make it? da 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 I don't care. I haven't voted on an all-star game since I was nine years old. And there was no damn internet for you to uh, cast a ballot. You had to physically put it in a paper box at Madison Square Garden. All I care about with the all-star game is watching it. We all know there's a bunch of nine-year-olds who sit in their bedrooms and vote for Dwight Howard and Yao Ming 20 times, even though Yao Ming isn't playing. He got like a million votes just out of China. But the fact is, let kids vote on the all-star games. I really don't don't give a damn. We know guys who should be there aren't going to be there and vice versa. It happens. I don't care. I watch the game and keep it moving. And to answer your question, how is there any way to really say uh, the East is going to beat the West? These guys are just going to get paid. Moving on to the next question from Joshua Mouse on Facebook. Will Gronkowski play? And if the Giants win, does Eli jump Peyton in the rankings? Well, look, I think Gronkowski will play, and at this moment, the fact that he's on a, or he's running around on a bum ankle, I think that decreases the Pats' chances of winning just a little bit. And it's not like Wes Welker is a scrub, and God only knows if Ocho Cinco is actually going to play or even play enough to go out and have a great game. Look, he could be the world's biggest and world's greatest decoy, but right now at this moment, I'm flip-flopping back from my original video, and I'm edging out with the Giants because of their defense. And in regards to Eli jumping Peyton, yeah, let's see what happens at the end of the game, and then we can talk. The guy can actually say, hey, man, I got two Super Bowls, and you got a bum-ass neck to your one Super Bowl. Moving on to this next question. Oh, man. Lionel Davis on Facebook. What do you think about LeBron James's hairline? That poor guy got murdered last night. Charles Barkley and Kenny and Shaq and, and maybe not EJ, but all of those guys murdered LeBron James' hairline. And I say, you know what? Give the guy a break. The guy uh, gets fourth quarter jokes all the time. Now he's getting dissed on TV because of his uh, receding hairline. Let LeBron live. The guy's going to have one or two, maybe three, maybe four, maybe five, whatever he says, more NBA titles. And just let the guy live. I'll make some hairline jokes myself. His hairline, I mean, he needs a tire size headband to wrap around his damn head. But I'm going to keep it on that note. It's Fan Friday. It's all about you guys and your comments. Make sure you hit me up on Twitter. Go find me on Google+. And if you haven't seen my videos from this week, we all know Floyd and Cotto are going to fight. Not Floyd and Pacquiao. Elon Manning, is he elite? Nick Diaz and Carlos Condit tomorrow, UFC 143. Blake Griffin or Kevin Love? Which one would you choose? It's Fan Friday. Hit me up on Twitter. Go find me on Google+. Plus. This is what I do all day. I talk to all of you guys. And if you sent me in a Fan Friday question on Twitter, I'm going to answer every single one, all of you guys personally, later today. I'm out. It's JR. It's the Sport Brief. I'm running out of breath. Peace.